Mitsubishi clock battery. We have a Logitech mouse thing there. And we got Wi-Fi. March 2013. It's 11 years old now. There it is. Boot sequences. There's our USB storage thing. ST2000 VM003-1CT164. Hard drive indicator. Lights going. So it's doing something. 89, 93, 97, 100. Screw terminals. Here we go. Let's see. 1997. Working on updates. Now this looks pretty good. You know, the monitor. This is terrible. One point seven five terabytes free. And mine's one point eight one terabytes too. Downloads. Twenty twelve Jeep insurance. Twelve twenty eight twenty twenty two. Ooh, photo viewer gave us an option. How nice. That's nice. Ooh, the warmth to that's really nice, especially on a CRT. There's a there's a Samsung right there. <laughs> anyway, uh, let's. Whoa, what are you doing? Privacy cleaner. We're not. I'm not gonna log into that Facebook. That would be really bad. This is how people's accounts get hacked all time. I don't care about the browsing history of this computer. I haven't even found out what this wireless dongle is. It's a working one though. I'm just gonna do a scan because I want to back up these photos. Windows 10 Pro, 64-bit admin. I don't even want to experiment with this. I want to run my own experiment with XP on it. Get out. Why? Where? Okay, that was weird. The minimize button was gone. It changed to something else. Weird. Why is there a shortcut to recycle bin? It's right there. See, they enabled the network and the recycle bin in the user folder on here because it's easier. Or you can just go to... They want you to... Go to my PC in the my PC folders. Whoa, that's a lot of photos. 1.61 megabytes, there's no details pane, which is really stupid. So I'd like to know what the resolution of the photo. 2448 by 2448. That is high res 4x3, I tell you that. Wow. Potentially unwanted program, start now. 2019, May 2019. Spigot. What is spigot? That's nice. Not. Anyway, we know what spigot is. Oh, sh uncorrectable sector count. Oh, yeah. I want to put an SSD. Let's go to 800 by 600. Actually, 1366 by 768. That's the monitor that it had. Here it is the inside of the power supply. It's very clean. So let's manage this PC. I want to see how many restore points there are. Oh, that's not good. What's with Obama being on the last three computers that I bought? That's crazy. What is this recovery partition? Anyway, here goes Windows 10. This hard drive is not good enough for Windows 10. There we go.
Oh, it thinks it's an 8500. Anyway, it installed the driver. It's got a gigabyte of video memory. So it's based off the Radeon HD 8500, apparently. This is an R5 240. Look at that. It's working very well, even when we're in full screen. How about 1080p60? No tearing. No dropped frames. Brewed some coffee, we're gonna watch a video to celebrate this excellent Windows XP machine, the Dell Optiplex 790. Ta-da! Nice, we're all set. Here's the temperatures. Well, here's strike one, trying to format a hard drive. This is so bad. What a piece of crap. Alright, I took the graphics card out, because I can use that CRT temporarily. Well, that's not good. What the hell? Didn't happen last time. It's got to be the drive. We're going to use this hard drive that came with the gateway. See, it's going pretty fast. We have our, we have our compact CV535 monitor made by Samsung. NEC keyboard made by Chickeny. And a Logitech IBM mouse. Let's just do 800 by 600 for the video's sake. Change the picture to that one, because that's how I did on the Dell computer we had, our first computer that was connected to the internet. We got internet in 2004. SBC Global. I'm not going to do any upgrades to this system other than put the video card back in. Fly through this, watch. Says something funny though. Neither Driver Heaven nor D Force will take any responsibility for damage done to your system, you, or your girlfriend after using Tune XP. Here it is. Let's do our YouTube loading test. Three, two, one, go. Pretty slow. Well, this is my pal. It's not the new one. It's better on the new my pal. Get the sound of the crackle. Some loudmouth idiot in the other room has to ruin. So, I'm sorry about that. A22 is the newest BIOS from. 82118. Preparing to update. Sorry about that, I ran out of space, so you didn't get to see the rest of the BIOS update. What the heck is this all about? It's not fitting the whole screen. It is 1080p. At least it said it was. Yeah, there it is. Weird. Now, I fixed it. What I did was... Put it, I put it to 75 hertz. Got the tripod set up. Sorry about the moray pattern. Whatever else you get. Oof. 1080. No frames dropped. Still playing fall flawlessly. Almost said flawless for some reason. No frames dropped. Let's try a live stream. Let's load a few websites. Ding. Done. Oh wait. Now it's done. Yeah. 
Maybe it's our social media addiction. I keep whistling when I talk. Do eBay, Flea Bay, or the e ripoff, whichever you prefer. That was quick. Let's see how much these computers are going for. are just paying for the OS. 100 bucks. 44. That's got the i5 2400. 75 bucks. 19 bucks. 31 shipping. That's not too bad. This browser will say you're using Windows 10. Oh no, we're out of date. I had to, I had to sign in again for no good reason. Let me maybe do it again. Still not signed in. What the hell? YouTube Studio. Oh, I lost four subs in the last day. Lost four subs in the last 28 days. <laughs> oh well. So yeah, there's my newest video. 16 views. Going to another estate sale today. Got some stuff. Some cool stuff. No vintage TVs though. Have a flat screen. Sold that turntable yesterday. Look, now it has to reload the page just to switch the appearance. Sometimes. Of course it's not going to do that on camera. It was dropping frames when I wasn't in full screen, but now that I'm in full screen, it's not. That is so weird. That's dumb. Right now, everything is going extremely well. I formatted the flash drive. YouTube runs well. Did some Facebook Marketplace listings, stuff like that. It's pretty speedy, no, no weird hangups or anything. 5.5. 5. 5. Hey, get back here. There it is. 5.5. 5.